Welcome to Steph Reacts. In this video, we are going to react to Roast Me. This episode 3. But before we begin, you know I will give you some amazing facts of the day. Did you know that dead skin cells are main ingredients in household dust? Hmm. I did not know that. But let's go. Awesome, awesome. Y'all on right there. We on there, fellas. Jaya, 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 Jaya. Welcome to another episode of Roast This, the funnest podcast to hit airwaves. I'm your host, Brandon Lewis. I'm never alone. I'm always with my people. I'm always with my family, my dogs, all the way from Detroit, Michigan. Y'all give it up for Chris. CP. What up, what up, what up, though? Hey, man, I'm in the field right now. Crazy. Yeah, you in the field? Crazy. See if you got in there for usual. See if you got in there. Hey, and last but not least, always in between but never seen, my nigga Dean. Y'all give it up for Kadeem, who always holding it down on the ones and twos. What's up, y'all? What's up? My nigga Dean. What up, Dean? Happy, happy Tuesday, y'all. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling for the happy Tuesday, bro? Happy Tuesday, my biggity brother. Yes, sir. Everything's good, man. How, how was your weekend? Weekend was good, man. I watched a little college basketball. Did you watch any? Yeah. I did. did. You did? I bet on some. You bet on some? Yeah, I bet on some. Man. State I'm lost, right. man. Who lost? Michigan State, bro. Oh, that's Michigan right. Michigan State, State, yeah. They lost to Duke. That, that's the only game I actually watched. Y'all was up in the What's third, up? though. Yeah, I know. Oop, minutes left. Hey, CP, yeah, I'm going to mute you till you're ready. Let me know when you're ready, CP. Yeah, we just yeah. beat them, but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dame, I watched, I watched, I watched. Uh, oh, oh, let's let's not. Hey, hey, CP, I know, I know, you can't talk, but you can hear us. Put your cash app in, my nigga, because we gonna celebrate your birthday. Happy yeah. birthday, to the funniest nigga I know. You know what I'm saying? The motherfucking improv genius. Fresh, top off the dome, funny, my nigga, CP, man. Happy belated birthday, my yeah, nigga. Yeah, they go ahead and mute. Go ahead, people, CP. I need the people to show you love, you, man, and grant you, you some bro. blessings. Shoot I don't know how to change way, my name. Yeah. I got you. Is, is it comedian CP? I got you. Yes, yeah, comedian yeah. CP, right? Yeah, comedian CP, man. Make sure everybody watching right now. Show CP some birthday love, man. Shoot him a dollar, two dollars, hell, twenty dollars, three hundred dollars. Shit, you know what I'm saying? Just show him some love in the cash out. Bless the cash out. And also, while you're watching this, share this live with your friends. Click the star right there. I think it's at the top left or bottom right. Click the star to follow. And to watch all the episodes of upcoming shows on All Def, follow us. Mine's is Big Bang Lewis and that comedian CP. Dean, you got a uh, caffeine? It's, a, it's, it's pretty much Cathadius right now. Same thing. I'll put okay, it up there later. Don't worry about it. Also follow Cathadius. Yeah. Uh, you, you might got to uh, Yeah, I'll put it, put that up. Don't even worry about it. We'll, we'll, we'll get to that later. Billy, we'll get to that later. Don't even worry about that, big dog. Shout out to <laughs> that. Though, okay. And last but not least, man, everybody watching, man, make sure you uh, tell a friend to tell a friend and subscribe to Caffeine. Get an app because Roast Me Season 5 is coming back next week. That's and Ronnie right, the Bill. Earlier, Roast Me Season 5, the classroom edition, will be streaming right here on Caffeine for free March 30th, next Wednesday. Yep. Uh, the time and location is subject to be announced, but next Wednesday, make sure you guys are all tuned in. Tell a friend and tell a friend to don't miss the opening episode because that shit will be bananas. Oh! And last but not least, while we still giving intros and paying bills, welcome to the show, man. My dog all the way from Atlanta, Georgia. My boy, my boy, what it is, what it is. Bless that fuck. Ronnie Jordan. Y'all give it for Ronnie Jordan in the building. What's up, man? Good to be seen. Good to be seen. How y'all kings doing? Y'all right, brothers man. all right? Everybody everybody good? Everybody you know good? Saying? Saying? We, ble we blessed it, fuck. Matter of fact, you know what I'm saying? We blessed uh -oh. as a motherfucker. You, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. 
You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. You know, hey, make sure y'all see this merch too, man. Lewis merch is coming right there, but uh, I'm gonna promote my dog right here, man. Blessed it for we blessed it for today. Here we go to my brother, man. We blessed this motherfucker. Uh oh. Make sure y'all copy blessed my wife blessed AFF blessed AF dot com. Yes, sir. Right, Ronnie. Well, blessed AF dot com. I'm gonna go ahead and get see official blessed AF dot com. Oh, official blessed AF dot com. Blessed it for yes, sir. Merch going crazy. Lewis yeah, merch coming soon. You know what I'm saying? But oh, you got the camo. You got the camo. You know huh? I got the colorful camo on that bitch. You feel me? It's coming though. CP, you good? CP, you good or not? You still, yeah, you still making moves. Right, there. Still, yeah, I heard him. Yeah, but, uh, I heard some lava cake over there. Ronnie, what's up, man? How was your weekend? Dial, let the people know how your weekend was. With your oh, weekend was, was good, good, man. Weekend was good. Got to kick it with the kids and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Uh, always a good time. Been been busy all week, man. These, you know, these writers' rooms, man. They got the yeah. damn. They're all day. <laughs> yeah, that's real. So I be enjoying my weekend, man. Thanks. Right. Uh, Billy, I know, I know, I know. People in the comments keep asking where Billy at, where Bill old man Billy. He was supposed to be on this today's episode, man. We couldn't get in contact with him, man. But we send loves and prayers to Billy Surreal, aka Billo. You know, what I'm saying I know we had our differences in the past, but that's my dog. That's my motherfucking brother. And uh, yeah, man. Hopefully he'll be on next week. Yeah. And, uh, hopefully, hopefully he'll uh, be more in store. You know what I'm saying? For, Absolutely. Um, we all, we also actually do ever have somebody in the. Uh, in the uh, auditions as well. We got a few more auditions. I know last week we had Pretty Boy Vito show up pretty well. And sorry, I'm forgetting the, the young lady's name that was on here with us. I think he is meaning Randy Sky. Funny Man Vito and Randy Sky was in the episode two. That was on here last Randy, week, y'all. Randy, 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 Randy Sky. That was Randy, Randy Sky. Sky. Thank Randy you for Sky was mind. funny, but what Randy was his Sky name? Was what was he? Uh, uh, Funny Boy Vito, I believe his name was. I know, I know uh, CP Vito. said he looked like a glizzy. He oh, Funny like Man Vito. Hey, Funny, funny Man Vito was funny, bro. He was. He was. He came funny Man Vito, hey, hey, in my, in my book, hey, in my book, if I was uh, Simon Cow, that nigga made it to L.A. <laughs> <laughs> he was to work. If I was Simon Cow, that nigga going to nah, L.A. he got down. What y'all niggas talking about? Uh, we talking about Funny Man Vito last week. Funny Man Vito made the show, in my opinion. You said he looked like a glizzy. Yeah, call him in a whole hot Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> nigga. Sauce his, sauce his head. <laughs> nigga name should be Brad. Bratwurst Brad. Bratwurst yeah. Brad face ass. Yeah. Brad what up? Brad. What up, Ronnie? What's the word? You look like you, you like you're in the writer's room right now. You look like you ain't nah, leaving. Nah, nigga. I'm at the ATM while you bullshitting. You cashing out. Hilarious. That's, that's the most ball of Zoom ever done before. Like, <laughs> we can hear the dude. You can hear it on the background. You can actually hear him typing the numbers in. Get for real. Get Don't be trying to guess my numbers, neither. Don't right. be trying to guess my motherfucking numbers. Ain't nobody, get, ain't nobody guessing them numbers. Shout out to everybody on YouTube, man. Yeah, shout out to everybody on YouTube, man. Hey, that song going crazy on uh, TikTok. That, uh, that, uh, he from Detroit, nigga. Yeah, that's that nigga right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you were talking about got the uh, what's the song with it? With the studs be clapping their boots. Every song on that goes on TikTok, I think everyone heard it before because it's all over the place, and that's what reason why persons don't really listen to the original song because they already hear it. And the positive thing about that is, me, I haven't heard songs until I heard it on TikTok. So I had to research the song and to find out that the song was out years before. So it's a positive thing with TikTok sometimes, positive by negative. Booty. Yeah, that song, that song. <laughs> what song is that? Hey, what song is that? Chat, chat, chat. What's like that? It's, it's from Detroit, though. Yeah, what song is that in, in the, uh, I'm pretty sure the chat, though. Somebody in the chat has to know. Somebody name it in the chat. What's the I, name I of the song? I need, the clap, the clap I challenge. Need, uh, the, uh, matter of fact. Damn what it is, bro. I think I got that song. Hold on. Yeah, I do got it. His name Louis Ray. Pull Louis that stuff, man. Pull Louis it up Ray. and play that uh all right. Let me go get it. Let me go get it, Louis Ray. Uh, anyway, you oh, we must go ahead and cut that feed. Y'all better oh, okay, head over to okay, caffeine. Okay, okay. Right now, right now, if you're watching, uh, if you're watching this uh podcast right now from YouTube or Facebook or Instagram, 
You have about 30 seconds before we cut it off and it would be officially on caffeine. So right now, if you're watching this from your YouTube, from your Facebook, or from your Instagram, make sure you go to Caffeine in your app store. Download the app to watch for free. Just go ahead and download the app on Caffeine. It's absolutely free. It's no gimmicks. You don't got to put your credit card in. You don't got to put a debit card in. Download the app right now to finish watching the episode of this podcast and every episode that's coming soon and roast me season five march 30th so right now if you're watching this from youtube or from facebook you got about 30 seconds and counting to go to, to your app store download the app caffeine follow us all day watch the show right now for free and then also follow myself big bank lewis at comedian cp and at ronnie jordan follow us on that caffeine so you can stay tuned and stay up to date for everything that drops. There we go. And shut it down right there on YouTube. Hold on. Oh. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. We off on YouTube right now? We off, off on YouTube. Oh, we off on Facebook there. right there. Uh. Yeah, just like that. All right. So we hey, do hey, have. Hey, hey, Dean. So when yeah. you get the song, hey, so when you get the song, it's called Louis Ray Cash App and go to minute 120. Okay. Louis, Louis yeah. Ray Cash App. 120 yeah, on the minute. Go to minute okay. 120. Okay. Sound good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But uh, anyway. Yeah, yeah we do. We are. Good. We do actually have somebody in the uh, waiting for the audition as well, though. I'm gonna let CP get really? set up. Yeah. So we already got somebody waiting in the wings. Trying to, you know, trying to, trying to, trying to uh, pretty much show up. Like, okay, right, man. So let me, funny, man. let me, let me, let me go ahead and uh, introduce this segment right here. So right now, people, everybody watching, man, everybody listening and tuning in, we are about to start auditioning auditioners so the people who have been auditioning for roast me season five man this is their chance to kind of uh showcase themselves to our audience prior to the uh season five or if they even make it to season five they get to you know kind of uh introduce themselves to our audience and uh let the people know who they are and where they're from and, and kind of give a little you know a little short teaser of their skill set so with that being said kadeem could you do me so kindly Bring in the first guy. All right, man. Uh, before we get this thing, before you go crazy, before you go crazy, nigga, before you go crazy, uh, let the people let the people know who you are, where you from, man. We see it uh, on my end. Okay, here you go, Johnson. So uh, just tell the people who you are, man. Where you from, dog? Hey, hey, what's going on? It's nice to meet everybody. I'm Prentice Johnson from Minneapolis, Minnesota. What's up? And uh, you, you're a stand-up comedian or you just a roaster? What you do? What you do for a living, brother? Oh, man. I am a, a roaster. Yes, absolutely. Uh, we call it cat here in the Midwest. Okay. Uh, I'm also a an entrepreneurial spirit. Uh, uh, published a, a new book. Uh, it's coming out pretty soon. Uh, right. Leap in the Fall. Yes, right. absolutely. And uh, last, last and last but not least, uh, how, how many bitches do you catfish on a daily? <laughs> how many? <laughs> I use uh, I use the same name. I use the same name all day. Beauty, 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 beauty's in the eye of the beholder. You know, yeah, I introduce beauty, it as me, Mr. Left Balls Worthy, nigga. Fuck you talking AKA about. that old nigga, AKA clean hands only. AKA boss lying entity. AKA the the beat is for broken record. Commodore shirt wearing that nigga. AKA stylistic shirt wearing that nigga. AKA the bag up for the goddamn Commodore shirt wearing that nigga. I'm on your ass. AKA ha fuck your coochie cousin. Oh yeah, you weird, boy. You definitely stop (laughs) bitches. He ain't he ain't got on no pants right now. Hey Lord, I'm first. No pants whatsoever. Hey, if you ever got a weird DM, this the nigga who did it. Hey, hey y'all all look like Funhouse Prentice Johnsons. Hey, can y'all hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Who is this scary looking ass nigga? Looking like the nigga on uh on Tales from the Hood. Who was like, oh, you get the shit. Whoa, no, you get good. the shit. I'm good. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm good. Hey, Skinny Funhouse, me. Oh, I thought that was right. Hey, I see you back. Take them long ass. Pro tip, pro tip. If you 
are auditioning for a show on its live stream. I think you should really take out the time of your day to make sure that everything goes smoothly because this can be an opportunity for you to start off your career as a comedian. So make sure your internet is right because I cannot really hear anything he is saying. So if he if this was an opportunity for him, he has failed in my opinion. I see, you, I see you back. Hey, this ain't twisted. Hey, hey, no, hey. Oh, hey you got them apple oh. snatchers off. Hey, 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 nigga. Hey, this nigga on the bed at Texas his jokes. Hey, text the joke, nigga. <laughs> hey, hey, CP. This nigga, T. CP Barber got a, a booty finger pay service. No, nigga, fuck that. You saber tooth preacher looking ass nigga. Hey, hey, CP, <laughs> CP saw you eat the nigga that had a father hey, and the no, daddy. Nigga, no, <laughs> you a vampire, nigga. You look like you, you look like you hey. play upright bass. You say what? Hey, CP's like eye trying bass. to cover up his eye, man. <laughs> hey, like, hey, 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 only day the nigga got his house is a computer and a chair. You better stop stocking the crib. He looks like a villain from, he Brandon, like a villain from Brandon, the yard, too. Back on the yard. <laughs> uh, uh, hey, hey, your Wi-Fi went out. But matter of fact, while you at it, real quick, man, if you guys think Prentice Johnson should be on a... I don't think he was prepared because when he was introduced... You have to, in my opinion, as a comedian roast, talking with other comedians, you have to be locked in because jokes can be um, thrown at you left, right, and center. So I don't think he was prepared for that because Pilu even told jokes on him. Comedians, CP told some jokes, and even Ronnie Johnson may have told some jokes. I do not recall, but you have to lock in. You have to be ready. Just in case anything pops off. Episode of Roast Me Season 5. Right Hell now, no. we have dropped the poll in the comment section. So right now, if you're watching, we dropped the poll in the comment section. Vote yay or nay, yes or no, if you think Prentice Johnson should get a shot at Roast Me Season 5, which I drops March so. 30th. The Prentice class Johnson got a Kev on stage poster on his wall. <laughs> I think he owe all us like forty bucks just for hey, that. Man. He he, he hey. Us. hey, I'm about to be at the crib in like fifteen minutes. I'll be right back. All right, bet. Back home. That nigga Prentice. That nigga Prentice is. That nigga Prentice got a creepy car. I know you got a creepy ass car that he follow people in. He had on. Uh, he looked like a medallion member at Burlington Coat Factory. Like it looked like they gave him that car to get in a ceremony. They was like, look, <laughs> we just got. <laughs> we know you've been here twenty years. Here you go. This is Stacy Adams' original cardigan. That cardigan came with some shoes, belt, socks. He looked like Twister at a, at a Bible study. So right now, right now, we got a poll going in the comment section. If you think Prentice Johnson should get a chance on season five of Roast Me, the classroom edition, which drops March 30th, right here on Caffeine, let us know in the comment section, yes or no, if you think Prentice Johnson should be on a episode of Roast Me. I think, I think, if we need if we need bait for the sharks, he a good piece of meat. He he oh, is guppy for it's like he's he chump. He's he was chump for the sharks for sure. We need we we all we always need a nigga to, to, to. I can always remember um Brandon Brody. Oh my goodness, CP and everyone used to get on him with his face, acne Uzi and everything. That's what makes the show funny. But for for me personally, if if the person you're bagging on doesn't take the joke as a joke you could actually see the expression on their face and that's what make, makes the joke less funny because you feel like you're taking advantage of them in a way because they do not appreciate the joke and my personal opinion about it if you are not comfortable enough to get roasted you are not ready to be on the show roast me because you must be able to take the joke as well as give the joke to, you know to feed the sharks with so uh i still say no but you know that things could change yeah he he looked like he got like a, he only his, his porn history search only got feet in it 
he, he, he does so creepy as yeah, hell. He, he look like he likes to take them Reebok off. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that's, that's how he talked to people on, on the bus. It's like he just catch public transportation just to look at women's feet. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> hella funny. Uh, yeah. Dean, yes, sir. Uh, Dean, could Dean you, uh, how you doing, brother? I'm doing good, Ryan. I'm doing good, man. It's it's going good. It's going good. I got a. Could you? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. You know, I know what you're going to say. No, actually, no one else in the weight room. So we can actually, uh, waiting room. So we can actually jump into a, a, a topic right here if you want to. Hey, can I shout out to everybody in the chat? On, in, in, uh, caffeine, man. Shout out to all y'all on caffeine at running up the chat. Keep on running it up. Yeah, Thank shout, y'all out for uh, shout out to everybody. Shout out to everybody. Matter of fact, matter of fact, let's do a comment section uh, right now to shout out everybody in the comment section. Let me take a look right now in the comment section who we got going on, man. Make some noise right now. Drop flames. Drop five of them bitches if you're watching this right now in the comment section. Drop the fire emojis, man, and let us know that you appreciate us. I see it. Okay, I see y'all. Melo919, what's up? What's up? Shout out to Melo919. TMT Chris, what's up? What's up? I see y'all. Bovit19. Man Code 3, what's up? The real uh, the real Michael Scott. They in here, man. Shout out to all the comments, people. All the roast. Hopefully they can bring everything back to YouTube because you, YouTube is a great platform to actually post your videos because I feel as though putting it on a new app, I don't think everyone really, really enjoy it like that. That's why I wanted to take the opportunity to share it with you guys to be able to post new videos about roast meat because like my channel states is that laughter the best medicine is laughter. If you can laugh, even if you have a bad day and then anything like that, that's awesome because, you know, laughter brings out the best in everybody. This is in the comments too, man. We need somebody. We got to get some real talent on her because it's different when you get in front of people. You know what I'm saying? Way <laughs> it's way different. And then the, if way you can't do this, the classroom ain't even, don't even... So, Don't pull up to the classroom with that so, with the with the, with the amateur stuff. So yeah, I'm just saying the, the the parent of the poll already came through for 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 good old Princess uh, uh Princess Johnson there, and it was a uh no forty eight uh, yes five. That's that's so they pretty Shit. much that. Forty eight people said forty eight people said fuck no. <laughs> Come on, boy, five people, people five what people probably it? thinking like me is like give a nigga a chance because he good bait for the sharks 45 people agreed that he should not be on this that was just that was the numbers of his prime request they were like no nah, when won't you come <laughs> well we do got someone else waiting the wings right now if you want to go ahead and oh, we got who's, else? In, who's in the wings who's in the wings send them all up right. send them up all right here we go Dang, could you yes, do me so kindly my brother yes sir let's do it all right, man. Before you, What's before you up? go crazy, before you go crazy, before you got them be so excited, we want to uh, introduce yourself. Let the people know where you, where you're from, and, and what you do, man. We see your name on my, on my end. Maybe they see it on their end too. They do. They see it on their end. Uh, oh, they see it on their end too. Yeah, let the people know, man. Where, where you from? And what's your name? Chris Mosley, uh, from St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, living in Phoenix, Arizona, right now. Stand-up comedian. Uh, director, writer, all that good shit. Shout out to all that, man. What's your Instagram? What's your Instagram handle? Shout that out, my boy. Uh, I am Chris Mosley with a period in between each word. So I am Chris Mosley, you know, dot, dot, all that shit. All right, man. All right, man. You, uh, you good? Good, good with y'all. Yeah, I'm good. straight, man. Oh, yeah. Every day above the ground is good, nigga. Yeah, I'm straight. Hey, I like that. I like that attitude. I like, I like that angle, man. We see you got the Simpsons backdrop, man. What's that about, man? That I don't know shit. I just, it's the I used to get in trouble for watching <laughs> when I was I young. Watching, huh? yeah, I just was like, let me pick something that stand out. You know what I'm saying? Already, I man. I love yeah. one of my favorite shows. What 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 makes you think you a good piece for roast me, man? Because I I've I've been roasted my whole fucking life, so I heard it all. If you can take a joke, you can give one. You know what I'm saying? And it's it's a difference between good how to do it, good how to do it. If you can take a joke, you can give one. Because I still feel as though person's casting on roast me, Billy, he can take a joke. I mean, he can give a joke, but he can't take a joke. Because you can look on their face, you can look the way they act and everything. Because the main thing is with Billy is that every time they say gay jokes about him, he doesn't take it well. The next time they upload a new video, 
look at his expression. You could actually see what I'm talking about. Like snapping and roasting. Like I love to write. I love to talk shit. But I like to talk shit to where if I'm talking shit about you, you laughing too. So I, I love to have fun. You know what I'm saying? Like I love it. Like and I watch this shit. Like I be watching this shit. I almost got into two accidents watching this shit before. Like while I was driving. And I just I I just, I just, just know I'm a good fit for it. I'm like, if I ever got a chance to at least audition for this shit, I know I'll go all in. All right, got you, got you. First of all, give us our dick back. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, give us our dick back. Uh, we got it. We in relationship. Yeah, you, you, yeah. Hey, they in the comments roasting the shit out of Chris, dog. Hey, 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 hey. I'm not going to lie. They smoking, Chris, they smoking right now. Bro. They're roasting the shit out of you. Going hell. I wish I could see it. It's not a form of transportation. Hold on, let me see. What's the... They is on your head, boy. They said roast that boy's eyes straight. Like, come on, dog. What you say, man? They said roast that boy's eyes straight. I was like, come on, man. Yeah, yeah. You cross out of my nigga. I ain't even pay attention. If I am, I can't see it. Right. It might be talking about me. Is this me? It, was that was that for me, guys? It, it, we already know Ronnie and Wright. I just do what he want to when it feels like <laughs> it. So I Ronnie. had a long day. Y'all kiss my ass on Sunday and Monday. Hold on, man. My app not my app ain't up there. I'm trying to see what they saying, man. Shout out to Chris man. Moses, man. Shout out to Chris Moses. I picked you. I picked you, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. I picked you, bro. You had a funny audition. Said, sorry, I, sorry, I lied, Bart. Oh, I'm just man. trying. Um, B. Lou should have posted his audition because that'll give us a backstory about Chris Mosley to see how funny he is. I didn't want to move to Arizona. Face that. <laughs> <Come on, Chris. laughs> hey, I wish I could crazy. see. I wish I could see what they look like. Yeah, bro. Hold on, man. I'm trying to read the comments. Boy, right? Hold on. Head, boy. Head head head. Okay, I, I got it now. I, I, I got it now. They own his ass, though, man. <laughs> Shout out to everybody in the comment section, man. Right now, right now, we dropped the poll, man. We just dropped the poll, man. Let us know if you think Chris Mosley should be on the episode of Roast Me Season he 5. He didn't roast it, though. He didn't roast nobody. I think, my opinion, he just introduced himself. But the feel, I, I feel so he has the confidence. And uh, the right attitude to be on roast me based on what I've seen so far. So I think he should be given a shot. I mean, I mean, he, he, right now, right now, he got he got good energy. The nigga, right. listen, he wasn't, I, I, he wasn't very, he wasn't very, you know what I'm saying? I like that. He wasn't very like on, you know what I'm saying? So I already, I already know the nigga funny. I, I, uh, yeah. I accepted his audition, so I know the nigga funny. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Are we supposed to just go in and go? Are we supposed to just go in and go? Yo, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, okay, cool. Hey, you know yeah. when they said, hey, you know when they tell you uh lick pussy to get a beard? Ronnie Jordan got his pussy, got his beard from licking trans pussy. Oh there it is. That's one of the that's one of the Go ahead, fire off. I didn't hear that. Damn. Oh, you hear that one more time? Go ahead and say it one more time, Chris. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's, I didn't hear it. You went out. It's already said and done. Ronnie yeah. Jordan. Oh no, uh, we, oh, oh no, we heard it. I was just gonna send your ass to detention. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you we heard that motherfucker. Right. Hey, hey, nigga, you throw your teeth like Batman throw his weapons. Like yeah, we heard the motherfuckers. Maybe maybe it's maybe it's maybe it's not the right energy. Maybe it's not the right energy for him. <laughs> you oh, fake your money, but my thing is. But what he's doing is that when he tell us jokes, it's like he's waiting for approval. You have to have that confidence to know that your joke is funny. That's the way others will laugh. You cannot just wait because even though the joke may be funny, if you don't have the confidence behind your joke, it's going to sound boring, you know? On death to uh, collect the GoFundMe money. Uh, yeah, man, what you doing? Wow, yeah. Keep a good impression on me, brother. Let me see. Uh... I think he's losing confidence. All right, Chris Bosch. Goddamn. <laughs> hey, the sound of bacon frying gives you an erection. Shannon Brown like you gotta... 098 says, a young Chauncey Billups. I do see Chauncey Billups right there. I was trying to – that was a good right, – I, right, right. I, I do see a little Chauncey in him. Uh, man, what the fuck, Marlon Wayans? That was from Jordan. He's like you got a mouthful of iPhones. <laughs> <laughs> if I click my heels three times, you will take me to Burger King. Hey, Chris Liddy. You tomato, look like you're tomato, working for right now. Bro. You got to pull around to the front window, my boy. Look. <laughs> <laughs> my boy, hey, big boy. Big boy, go on up to the front. We got you, big dog. You shaped like you a fluffer at Denny's. All right. That was great. Yeah, man. This soda has been empty. The boys say, boy, look like JJ Ice Fish. So right now, man, in the comment section, man, let us know if you think Chris Moses <laughs> should be on the episode 
of Roast Me Season 5, man. We're going to bring you back. Stick around in the waiting room. Tell them to stick it's around in the waiting room. I'm going to bring them back when it. CP come back. Tell them to uh, stick around in the waiting room, Dame or Jay. Let, let them know to stick around. We're going to bring them back right now. Yeah, no, he, he can still hear you, uh, uh, Bilu. Okay, yeah, so just yeah. tell them to uh, yeah, just tell them to stick around uh, for when CP come back. I'm, I'm going to put them against a real shark. All right. And, uh, yeah, you, and, uh, we need the amateurs to go against each other. That's what I, I, I want to see them. You know what I'm saying? Go, go True. head to head. Oh, yeah, that is it. Uh, is, is the other dude, is Prentice still in the uh, waiting room, Dean? So I see someone else here, but they ain't, they haven't turned on their webcam or anything, so I'm not going to put them on the screen until I see something on that end. Yeah. So, we so if somebody on. could, uh, Jay, if you can get that other person to get their attention, to get them ready, and yeah. uh, we're going to bring them both back when they both in the uh, waiting room, Dean. Just, uh, just give me the heads up, and then we're going to get them back going. Somebody said he looked but, like uh, a worm that be in them apples. <laughs> but right now, but right now, let's. Uh I don't think that was funny. I don't think that was funny. Let's go. But nice try, though. Uh, switch, motherfucking topic. <laughs> Topics. Oh, Let's God. get to these motherfucking topics, D. Oh, yes, sir. So, so we starting. I think we can start with this. Y'all want to start with the uh, the the, the push and tea? Mm -hmm. we, we going we going to arbitrate. Yeah, man. You, yeah, man. That's, yeah. A, that's a very husky topic. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and just run the, run the I'm gonna run the ad real quick. Y'all, let's watch it real quick. What let's think? run it. Let's see what's going on. Push a P. Uh, push a T. Just did a, a diss track McDonald's to Arby's. Let's do it. I'm, I, I mean, I I'm top. Hard. Off top, what I think is that uh, uh that was great advertising. What that was, I had to pause the video. That was uh, what your boy named Pusha T's commercial for Arby's. I paused the video because of copyright infringement. I didn't want to get copyrighted, so I paused it. Advertisement by Arby's, you know what I'm saying? And uh, that, that was great. They really went out their way to push this fish sandwich. They ain't go too far. They should have hit me up with the sandwich to try it if y'all really want to all that rapping and shit. Send me the sandwich. Just DM me the sandwich so I can try it. <laughs> nah, bro. But you know what? You just, anyway. I ain't even gonna hold y'all, man. I ain't never really, I ain't never had no fish filet at McDonald's. You ain't never had a McDonald's. That's the hood, that's the hood nope. first healthy option for dudes in the hood who really be outside all day. They're like, well, let me get a fish filet. Got but no see, extra tartar sauce. I'm used to the fish fries. I'm used to going pulling up to a fish fry and getting me a fish sandwich with coleslaw. Mustard. I ain't gonna hold you up though. See, I ain't gonna hold you up, uh, B. Lou. But that Arby's fish sandwich would be busting anyway. Four push T got on. I'm just telling you all the fat people knew. Oh, so the sandwich, knew. oh, so the sandwich been out. Sandwich got um, it might be hidden already. That's all I'm gonna tell you about. Just so you know, we got a poll running. Uh, especially if you high. We got a poll run. McDonald's versus Arby right now in the chat. We got a poll running right now in the chat. Where I'm living, we don't have Arby's, so I automatically have to give it to McDonald's. But if you disagree with me, please let me know in the comments below. Okay, right now, right now, you know we like to interact with our fans, man. We love y'all who watch us and support us every Tuesday right here on Caffeine. So right now, we got a poll going in the comment section. What do, what sandwich do you guys prefer? You prefer the McDonald's or the Arby's? Me personally... I'm a McDonald's nigga, but I like Arby fries because they got the curly fries. You know what I'm saying? And I like the chicken Arby's? sandwich. I like the chicken sandwich at Arby's over the chicken sandwich at McDonald's. You, I ain't gonna hold. You know what's the sleeper? Because you know I'm a, I'm a connoisseur of all things delicious. Shout out to all the fat people in the chat. Yeah. CP, go to the drive thru and get your Arby's Market Fresh sub. <laughs> I mean, Market Fresh sandwich. That wheat sandwich at Arby's, but. Hey, no hold on. First of all, hey, I fuck with Arby's. Me and my mom be getting the Italian from that bitch. What you know about hey, that Italian? Hey, that Italian went too. Yeah. Italian went too, man. I fuck with their curly fries. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, they got a solid curly fry that you can rely on. And that bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. CP, the curly fries CP, is fine, my boy. CPB Lou, can I give y'all some fat boy exclusive shit? They got a caramel chocolate chip cookie. They got with salt on it. It got salt and, yeah. And they got a triple chocolate chip cookie. So, it's it's a lot going on. If you you know how when you hot yeah. you gotta have salt and hey, sweet. Hey Ronnie, Ronnie, can I can I can I tell you something? <laughs> Stop putting salt on your motherfucking cookies, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's why Ronnie is big now. Oh my goodness. 
They put the salt on the cookie, CP. I, I, oh, I, I, I wasn't oh, living this way. Oh, 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 you think they give a fuck? Did this to me. Don't you, don't you? Listen, listen. I get it. I just seen the little salted cookies. We can't be doing that, Ronnie. No, bro. No, we, we got too much to live for, my baby. We can't be having salt we pepper do. cookies. We can't have salt yeah. pepper cookies. Yeah. <laughs> we can't be having no goddamn uh, seasoned salt uh, fucking uh, lemon meringue pie cookies. We can't do that, bro. We season everything. It's salt on the cookies. Oh, what's next, man? Ronnie, me and I marinate them, uh, marinate them donuts and beer overnight. Put them bitches on the grill. Ooh, please. Donuts will fall off the motherfucking floor. You understand me? Hey, you know the funny part that black people... Don't nobody eat the roast beef at Arby's. Arby's, we don't fuck with the Yeah, they ain't never gonna play. So what the fuck is an Italian? What the fuck is an Italian? Hey. With that market fresh chicken sandwich. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie hey. to you. My mama was here talking about she was, uh, you don't be quiet, Billy Parker. I'm gonna tell you. Hey. Like, hey. I got up my mind. Shut up your mind, dude. Hey, hey, that, hey, that, hey that chicken sandwich at Arby's be hidden, my boy. And that but it's the market sandwich. fresh, the market fresh turkey sandwich on the wheat bread, bro, with the purple onions. I'm gonna tell you what, it's different. You <laughs> say with the purple onions. They probably don't even do purple onions anywhere. They probably just my hey, army. Hold on, hold on. They just do it for me. Do purple onions really have a distinct taste like that? They set it off. They sweeter. They sweeter. Man, this nigga Ronnie, this nigga Ronnie, keep his tongue in a in a bag like Uncle Phil had his pool stick when he had to come save uh, Will. Bring out Lucille. Hold on, uh -uh, I'm gonna fuck the dog. You know who you do? Harvey Dollar. Let me. They got a little yeah, tongue. Okay. okay. All right, but like, all right, all right. Let me see my tongue out of here. <laughs> Hey, look, I ain't even gonna hold you. I don't really eat onions. I don't eat onions at all unless they grill, my boy. So, yeah, I'm back. Yeah, back. Bro. I yeah, I don't like raw onions like that, no, man. man. Yeah. They hit you, every now and then. I ain't never, unless it's accident, nah, unless it's right accident, I don't eat the nah, bitches raw. Man. When they hit with that lettuce and tomato and that onion on that on that turkey with that wheat bread, it's different. You got my mom over here clapping, Ronnie. God damn. You need to open up a little, uh, a little church. So so look, my mom is a my mom is a caterer. First of all, if you're in the city of Detroit and you know, I'm talking about all your turkeys, everything, you know, you know, because your mom would be fucking up turkey and it ain't juicy. You need to come right. to KP. Anyway, um so my mom do the smoked turkeys. She dressed them bitches. Smoked turkey or something. Niggas don't eat. Uh, uh, fried, fried, my bad. Fried turkey, my bad. But look, fried turkey? Uh, fried turkey. She fried them bitches like, I mean, nigga. You know, I, you know I have a piece in my comedy special dedicated to fried turkey. <laughs> like, it's, it's a whole bit. <laughs> nigga, you just told me, you just told me, you just told me that you uh that you put Montreal steak seasoning on your chocolate chip cookies. I believe anything you say. I believe anything you say about what's on your special, man. That nigga said, man, please. I'll take some of that goddamn uh acid dressing and put that on a motherfucking sugar cookie. It will fuck you. So, so I'm just letting you know we got we do got two people for them to go head to head now. The uh the, the Reverend is back. Rookies. We got Prentice Johnson back, and we got, of course, we have Chris Mosley still waiting in the wings. If y'all want, want me to bring okay, him up, so they can go ahead. Check this out. Don't, don't playing, bro. Okay, so look. Hold on, so check this out right What's now, Dean. Before we get back to this segment, yes, sir. Uh, mute, mute CPM Ronnie. I'm yes. going to introduce the title match. And okay. And as they go Damn, in. Damn, now I can't hear. Every time that happened. Uh, Ronnie and CP. Fuck. All right, cool. I got so it. Bring right. the boys in, man. So right now, man, we're going to go back to the audition segment of the show, man. Right now, uh, before we, um, Prentice Johnson and Chris Mosley. I don't know. I don't know. We get this segment started, man. This is the audition segment where we audition people each and every week, man, and we pick some that we think potentially could be on season five of Roast Me. And this week we have Chris Mosley all the way from uh, St. Louis, by the way, by way of Phoenix. And we have Prentice Johnson 
all the way from Minneapolis, Minnesota. And uh, these guys feel like they got what it takes to be on an episode of Roast Me Season 5. So what better what better yet thing to do is to have them go head to head to see if they can go off the, off the cuff to see how funny these guys really are. So with me being the host of the classroom, I'm going to be the host right now. So uh, I'm gonna introduce y'all to this segment all the way. Uh, if before you keep keep before you keep going, Prentice, you are still muted on your side. So go ahead and unmute yourself real quick. Just want to make sure we can hear. There you go. All right. Yourself, like, well, you know, you there know, you go. So so, so uh, before we get this before we get this segment started, man, all the way from uh, St. Louis, uh, Missouri, uh, by way of Phoenix, Arizona, Chris Mosley and. Coming to the podcast all the way from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Prentice Johnson. There you go. Shoot it up. Hey, hey, Chris, you bring your forehead shield with you? Hey, you look like you licked ass on the first date. Oh, Chris. Oh, man. Okay. Chris, Mike, sounds like he is really, really far. And Prentice Johnson, he is not bringing the energy needed. To be a good roaster right now, so this is bad. Put your mic down. Put your mic down, Chris. You look like your finger got stuck in a nigga's ass and CP saw it. Pull it down so we can hear you. There you go. There you go. Go ahead. Now go. My bad. This nigga, your line is at the Goodwill. Hey, your teeth shine brightly. The energy is low. The energy is low. Look at, look at Bilu. He's tired, man. In the dark. Did you steal that wig from Wendy Williams? You got them Oculus glasses on. It look like you've been in the metaverse. Your forehead is a virtual headbutt. How big are you? What's your favorite song? Lose weight for what? Oh man. <sighs> this is bad. You look like you. Princess Johnson, internet is low. Hey, don't make all that noise in your mama We're house, nigga. Your, your, your elementary school picture. You look like you say shit like, nah, nigga, my mama live with me. <laughs> uh, yo, your mama's in my back room. Your baby mama claims. That was funny by Chris mostly, so I love to give a damn. Anything Princess Johnson is saying isn't funny. You on her taxes. You look like you don't have no money. <laughs> you lick dirty feet. You reuse condoms. All right, all right, right <laughs> now, man. Right now we gonna pause this segment, man. This shit getting out of hand, man. Let's uh let's 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 exit out Prentice. We gonna send Prentice to detention. Now bring Chris back. We're gonna send Prentice to detention. Let's bring in another contestant, man, all the way from, I'm not sure where he's from, man, but bring him in, Marcus, uh, real quick. Hey, y'all got to step it up, man. Hey, yeah, they, I, they, I'm going to try to pull him in real, real, real quick, be a little bit. I ain't, I'm not getting anything in, back. Uh, hey, that was like an awkward exchange between two victims. Y'all was like the two dudes that get bullied get uh, in an argument. The two I'm trying to give niggas <laughs> opportunities here, man, and niggas is, uh, you know, I'm trying hey. to give niggas Hey, 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 no, you're doing it. We're doing it. Don't argument. Worry. It was the most awkward, calm Christian roast. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to give niggas, uh, this nigga internet ain't loading right. Yeah, exactly. I don't know what's going on with Marcus, but I've not been able to pull him up that the whole time. So I haven't seen anything oh, on your side. So, so uh, Marcus, so, yeah. man, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know where you're running your shit from, man, but it seems like today's champion so far is uh, Chris Mosley. This is a perfect example of opportunity sometimes in life it is just for you if you don't take the opportunity to actually put yourself in position to be able to do stuff like this you're not going to go ahead and like sometimes you really if i know i'm going to be on roast me right let's say Bilu call me and tell me on june 2nd i'm going to be on roast me I am going to try my best to make sure my camera quality is good. I'm going to try to get a better router. I'm going to put things in place that will put me in a better position to be able to do good. So I don't think I don't think Chris Mosley really, really showed that he's a good roaster, but because 
he was somewhat prepared and put him in a position to be here today. So, once again, man, we're going to drop a poll in the comment section. Let us know if you think Chris Mosley deserves a chance on Season 5 Roast Me, which drops next week, March 30th, live on Caffeine. Let us know in the comment section. All right, Chris, stick around, man. We're going to bring you back one more time. Yeah. Appreciate everything you're doing, brother. Okay. Go ahead and get your ass out of here. <laughs> well, yo, that was awkward, bro. Them go dudes ahead, was funny as your, two uh, dead uh, babies. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Morning, keep bringing this joke with dead babies. It's not funny. It's not funny, bro. And go ahead and get they your bomb funny ass out of here. Dead, hey, hey, be loose. They were funny as dead babies. That was a. <laughs> it was funny. You are not funny like that, Ronnie. It's two dead babies. Hey man, I just want to let Woo! niggas know this shit, this shit ain't as easy as it looks, man. Niggas nah. think this shit is sweet. Niggas think this shit is sweet till you on camera. You're sober. It's in the middle of the day. We 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 we, we might film at eleven in the morning. You know what I'm saying? So you know, nigga, in the morning you ain't high for drugs. You ain't got the nightlife. You feel me? This shit harder than what it. Then it looked hey, like. And then and then it's harder than stand up too. This is like this is not stand up. You ain't got no immediate crowd feedback. You right on Zoom. You got to go. They did you see that awkward shit, CP? Did your mama see that? No, nah, uh, we I, I, I got a call and got knocked up. <laughs> what happened? No, nah, don't even. Well, we know we <laughs> do we just we know we had our song that we do every week. You said no. what happened? We had a it's contestant. Just, you know the contestant segment where we bring in the auditioners every week. So we right, had them. Right, yeah, right. We, we 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 had them face off. And uh it wasn't good, my boy. It just wasn't good. It was like it was terrible, bro. It was like it uh, was terrible. Right now, the poll says right now the polls are coming in and they got 12 people. Said say both funny. of them, no. <laughs> 12 people say they funny, 42 people say fuck no. <laughs> they are about as funny as a live stream abortion. Man. <laughs> I mean <laughs> CP. I had a little bit of a uh, little bit of laughing and no, I'm sorry. So look, um, I saw the one nigga who uh who got on here. He, he thought he was with, with them long ass teeth. Yeah. You talking about, you talking about Chris? <laughs> talking about this man right here? No, not goddamn. I mean, this nigga, you, you wow. You got a face on you. Remember uh, remember what, 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 remember, the, remember the junkyard dog from uh from the NBA? Remember him? Yeah, yeah. I forgot his name. God boy, you got a oh, a, a chicken fence for a grill. This nigga, Wait. this nigga look like a uh got a, some dream teeth. God damn. Keep up, my fanny. This nigga get a bag of frozen fruit and chew you a smoothie. Chris, you are smiling, but you got a fire back, bro. And what you need? Uh, banana? Strawberry <laughs> banana? Strawberry <laughs> banana? Do you need, you need a strawberry banana? God damn it. <laughs> no, nah, what's good, uh, T Mobile? Put that shit on your head. What's going on? <laughs> you written your gap about an Airbnb? What am I gap called Airbnb? What'd you say? With that goddamn Homer Simpson bottom of the face. <laughs> Well, that, that, that ain't got a strong ass this, don't he? Like he be telling strong me, strong ass like, this. Yeah! <laughs> he's doing this, Ricky. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they said Chris was like Baltimore in the face, nigga. Hey, <laughs> nigga what's up that background, man? Hey, like, he's he's the he's only one I can is, is what I picked up. Fuck I it. feel you, man. Hey, I feel you. You gotta stay quiet now. Nah, you gotta say you like the Simpsons. Don't be trying to be like, it's the only thing I can find. <laughs> like, I like this man. That's what's up. That's what's up. This shit. That's what's up, man. What you be doing for a living? Say it again. You y'all y'all kind of breaking up a little bit. I said, what what when, when are you getting a nose job? <laughs> <laughs> I love them prison <laughs> braids, nigga. Somebody <laughs> laughing in the background. I see somebody laughing in your background. <laughs> <laughs> somebody laughed at my background. Yeah, somebody said "aha," uh -huh. or oh, somebody I heard somebody. Oh yeah, that was, yeah. That, was, that, was, that was my baby. Oh man, that's funny. Yeah. All right, uh, all right, Chris. Yeah, man, thank you, Dan. Get his ass out of here. All right, Chris. Hey, shout out to Chris, man. You know, yeah, after we got roasted, man. Shout out to Chris, man. He wasn't bringing nothing to the table. Uh, well, he was like an extra. On, he looked like an extra on All American, goddamn. Oh, he looked like an athlete. That nigga do like he like he like a strong two guard. But uh, <laughs> we bring we bring practice all that we good. When hey, we so uh, let's let's try one more time, man. I'm all about opportunities, man. I know this means a lot to people, man. So yeah. let's try Marcus one more time, man. We're I'm gonna bring I, in the last contestant, Marcus. I, 
I, I'm still trying don't with him. Time, man. Don't say I'm, that we didn't give you a chance, that glad nigga. Hey, hey B Lou, I keep trying, man. I'm all, I'm all about opportunities, man. I know this shit means the world, niggas. B Lou, I keep trying, but it's it's can rain never coming through on my side. I don't see nothing, let's bro. Try, I'm trying. Let's try Marcus one more time, man. B Lou, can you hear me? Be look, say, what you say, uh, yeah, I'm about to say, yeah, no, we I keep trying to pull him in, and he's not, I don't see any camera on his side, so oh, he can't pull him out. on it, yeah, oh, they, and then he logged back in, Jason, yeah, 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 exactly. So I'll on. let you know if I see him, but it, it ain't, it ain't looking too look, good for Marcus. Why I look like you in the alley? Said, Who, me, <laughs> Nigga in the alley right now, hey man, come get these jokes, man, come get <laughs> 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 three card money back there, huh? <laughs> we think it's that, we said, think, they, no wrong they, answer, we think it's that. Put twenty nine pick up for it. Put twenty nine pick up for it. Put twenty nine pick up for it. Right. Listen, listen. Somebody said they picked Marcus over them two dudes anyway already. Damn, yeah. they already picked Marcus. All right, real quick, man. Let's pay some bills right now. That's tough. That's tough. That should tell you. Ooh. Man, if you're watching us, wherever you're watching us at, man, make sure you share, like, hit the subscribe button, man. Follow us. Tell a friend to tell a friend to watch us every Tuesday. Live 6 p.m. Uh, Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern on Caffeine. Make sure you follow us. I'm Big Bang Lewis. That's comedian CP. That's Ronnie Jordan. Dean, yeah. who's always in between but never seen as at Cathadius. Make sure that you uh, go to the App Store. Tell a friend to download the Caffeine app. Start your profile because next week, March 30th, Wednesday, Season 5. That's right. Season 5 of Roast Me will be back. The Classroom Edition. We'll be back live here on Caffeine, streaming for free. <clears throat> yes, sir. Hey, the man. people want CP, man. The people want CP in that classroom, oh, yeah, man. man. I, I mean, man. Niggas been hitting hey, me up like, is he going to come back? I don't know. I, won't you hear hey, him? Well, <laughs> CP, man, that's my pit bull, man. I, I stick that nigga on any nigga. Listen, man. man this what I, this what I promise. This what I promise. I'm back this season for sure. Now, I know we had some discrepancies or whatever. I'm back this season. However... I mean, you know, we we it's 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 a game time decision whether or not I can get straight to that first episode because I'm gonna be in New York filming, and I'm trying to fly back the day before and then get out of here. But I mean, nigga, shit, you know, um, I gotta do what I gotta do. Shit, I didn't, you know, I didn't I didn't dip my goddamn toe in this actor pool, and then motherfuckers, <laughs> a motherfucking alligator came out. Nigga, you funny. It was great. <laughs> <laughs> ah! You know what I'm saying? So, hey, we, see, you know, we saw your HBO Max, my boy. We seen your yeah, HBO yeah. Max, my boy. Now my mama won the Tesla, so it's like, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 hey NBA, hold, hold on, NBA Mills. That's actually not a bad idea. Maybe we'll start pulling that off. We might pull up on channels and start roasting what people. What do y'all think? One, one day we might pull up to another caffeine channel. Someone, someone streaming. We go over there and roast them. Roast them. What y'all think? One, one of these days. It's one of these rappers. They don't, sound, they don't sound bad. They don't sound bad at all. Like better, better idea. Better idea. Too. That's funny. Yeah, that might actually might be a little dope idea. But uh, we hey. got some topics still. We're going to get these topics. Topics. It's time to switch. Matter of fact, it's time to switch. Topics, nigga. Switch. Topics. What's the nah. topic? Can Dave give me some? Here we go. Y'all hear about this? Oh, man. Not the Jurgens. Damn, not, not the Jergens, though. Not the Jergens, not the, the, Jergens, cool. not the Ultra Healer. Hold on. Oh, not the Jergens, oh. not the Recall, man. I mean, apparently, not apparently, the recall on the apparently some. Ba- I got the uh, the Ultra Cocoa Butter Jergens. These are the bomb. These smell so good. You can't go wrong with these, though. You know. Right here, no, this isn't an advertisement, but, you know, it's pretty funny that I get one right handy. Don't think funny, but, you know. Bacteria on some jer- on, on some jargon, so that's start recalling some of the lotion around, uh, around, around town. That's a damn shame. You can't have nothing. You can't even have lotion. You know what niggas do with lotion? Man. <laughs> man, when I seen this, when, when I seen this, man, this, this, this is dangerous, but because this is, this is, uh. This ain't this ain't the top lotion, but it's top five lotion on jacking your dick. And it's up there. if you jack your it's dick with there. bacteria, 
you run a risk of getting that shit inside the hole. So you got but, to tread lightly, my boy. Yeah. The real yeah. niggas know you get the Walmart equivalent to this anyway. The Suave Equate is the same color as this. It, when it says to compare on there, you talking about when it says like compare to yeah, Jurgens? It's the same colorway. It's the same font. <laughs> got it. Don't even it just say Suave Equate on it, but it's it's this much bigger. It's like eighteen I more gallons. I think that's I think that's shampoo. Oof. <laughs> 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 they got the big lotion got there at Walmart. It say head and shoulders is real sticky. But you talk about getting that ass off you like nigga, wait a minute. <laughs> that, 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 that is crazy. 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 It's all about that motherfucking vino. Vino don't got no scent, bro. Nigga, what you need is nigga. That that with the cologne for. We take your pick. ass off. See, that's your problem. You want your lotion doing two things. Yeah, I, I, I like a little scent. Oh man. What's your, what's your flavor, Brandon? Brandon, tell him your flavor lotion. What's your, like what's your favorite? Favorite? Look, look. Hey, look, I like the cherry blossom jargons. Oh. It do got the cherry smell. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Thank you, bro. I like the cherry. The cherry blossom. <laughs> cherry blossom. Like the cherry blossom. He knew the original oh, scent. That's that original scent on there, bro. Oh, hey, look, 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 look. I like the smell. I'm not sure. clean on top of cologne. Oh, my goodness. You like the smell delicious. That's what you like. Hey, I I like, I, I look. I look. I like, I like my walk pad scent to smell just. Right. Nigga, hey, bruh, hey, bruh, hey, bruh. That might be the most <laughs> bitch shit out of there. Nigga, still in my walk by set to leave them stuck. Do you understand? <laughs> walk by set. <laughs> walk by set. <laughs> Nigga, come on. Not like that. I ain't hey. you, this my brother. But I'm saying, man, sometimes we be around our girl too long. You know what I'm saying? You know, the new baby come. We've been out in the house sharing lotions. You know what I'm saying? You got to snap out of it. I got to get you back on Call of Duty. <laughs> Brandon got the OnlyFans uh, kit for the lotion, boy. You got, you got to get my walk by air has to kill him. You know what I'm saying? Hey, These hey, walk by air, man. You know what I'm saying? The walk by, walk air, by air, air. Oh, duh. I know. I got the walk by air. Who like the walk by air? What you, want, what you want their reaction to be like? Oh, this nigga smells chill. Yeah, he smelled like, like, look, look, the walk by smell is like, damn, like, yeah, he smelled good. Yeah. And then they gonna ask me, what is that? You walk around smelling like a nigga X, and you go. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga, hey, okay. yo, come to you like a man. I'm gonna ask you one time, my nigga. Do you know three? Okay, that was funny. I must say, Ronnie did give a good joke. Yeah. So yes, <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, look at me, fam. All I'm I'm say. You. <laughs> Do you know Teresa? Yes or no? <laughs> Hey, look, his man's bro, behind him like hey, this. Look. So how is that gay? Cause I want to smell good, bro. Nobody they said hey, bro. It ain't man, gay, bro. It's the, but the way, you, but you said you want your walk by air to hit. That's what problem. <laughs> that was, that when I started to have a problem with it. That when I started to get challenged. Hey, hey, hey! You see, you ever, you ever see a nigga face when they be like, I know you ain't roasted. <laughs> 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 so what you trying to say, dog? Hey, dog, I just like to smell good, bro. That's it, bro. I just like to smell good, bro. I like there lotion, though, bro. I don't like lotions like a woman, but I like lotion, bro. But let me ask you a question, bro. Like, how many cherry blossom products do you think they make for niggas? I'm just saying, like, what's all the cherry hey, blossom? It's you know, like it's, it's, it's sound like you you might as well you might as well wear some yogurt, nigga. You might as well put you a yogurt on, bro. Hey, look, I know you ain't roasting. <laughs> No, nigga, no, no. I, I'm just saying, bro. Look, look. Okay, look. Y'all, I just told you. I just like that. Hey, in Jergens, I like the cherry blossom. I don't like cherry blossom in everything, bro. But yeah. in that specific brand, in that specific brand, I like the cherry blossom. So let me ask you a question. This is a real. And it might not even be cherry. Hey, Kadeem, is it cherry blossom? I, I, I'm actually looking up right now. It's actually cherry almond. I'm actually about to put it on the screen cherry for you. Almond, bro. It's wow. cherry almond. You smell like yeah, you so smell actually, like almond milkshake. You smell like almond milkshake. I was I was, uh, I was wrong on the blossom, bro. Yeah, it's it's all it's cherry almond. almond. Cherry, cherry almond, almond, bro. I like that flavor. That's what it is. I'm about to pull up on the screen so we Thank all know. You, bro. I, li yeah. I, li I like that flavor, bro. Here we go. Here we go. Here what, we go. What, what kind of lotion y'all use? 
Uh, regular. I don't know. Shit. I, I don't know what the hell it is. I use I use a vino, and what's crazy is we got a that's the one. Right down, right down. Look, so wait a minute. Is there something right. wrong with this Jergens or uh, or all the Jergens? Uh, uh, it is. It is at all. What they use. Everybody, a, put your lotion in the comment. What lotion do you use? Some of y'all use Aquaphor. <laughs> The tattoo no, stuff. no, 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 <laughs> fuck that. In the comments, I, I need the poll to go like this. Do y'all agree with Brandon Lewis lotion uh, choice or not? Yes or no? Fuck <laughs> everything else. You trying to get allies? You trying to get scary allies? Line, do you like Brandon Lewis lotion selection? Yes or no? We got, some, we got, we got some Lubadorum. We got some Lubadorum in the chat. Some Lubadorum. <laughs> <trash, bro>. <laughs> yeah, Lubadorum is a little too watery. Lubadorum is milk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some Johnson Johnson's and some Ascedrin. That's trash. A vino. A vino trash. That's Vaseline be hidden. Vaseline be hidden. Hey, no, nah, don't put your hey, don't put your goddamn eczema medication in here, neither. We talk about regular <laughs> lotions. Y'all, y'all, y'all put y'all, y'all coming in here I with all the exactly. Palmers. Oh, hey, don't bring all that Lupisha lotion to sit in here. We talk about the regular Please, shit. Please. I fuck Please, with Palmers, though. Eight. I don't fuck with no uh I fuck with Palmer's though, bro. I fuck with Palmer's. Palmer's it. So for eight, uh, <laughs> like, <laughs> damn. So for hey, eight, what's another shampoo? I thought somebody said you, you see her. You, you, you what's it called? What? Userin. 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 Userin straight. I like Userin, dog. I like Userin, but it, it do sound medicine, you know. It do yeah, sound it like sound, uh, it sound medicine, like mother. Yeah, like you know, like you in a fire. With, like you uh, in a fire. Shout out to everybody I fuck, who I fuck, I fuck with Nivea. I fuck with Nivea, bro. Yeah, she cool, but we, we talk about lotion. <laughs> <laughs> I, fuck, I, fuck, I, fuck with the, I fuck with the sing and the lotion. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right now, in the polls, is coming up. 20, 21 people say no. Some say yes. Fuck y'all niggas who said no. Somebody said, Nivea, Body, Gold Bond. Gold Bond is like you got to be 70. Yeah, Gold Bond. Hey, get your athletic, athlete's foot cream. You got to be 73 to Gold Bond. That's, that, they just brought that back out with Shaq. Somebody said Cocoa Butter. Man, get your lame ass on. Yeah, so, you know, we got one more topic, Cocoa just so y'all know. If you want to hit that black one. candy one from Halloween. That's the orange and black candy, Cocoa Butter. Oh, yeah. What? And shout out to uh, I am from Card County, Georgia, man. So fuck y'all niggas, man. Who think otherwise? I uh, never say Atlanta. I say Card County, it's man. It's not Atlanta. It's not Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? It's a suburb. <laughs> she it's wasn't even Atlanta, Atlanta when she did the video. Both y'all niggas. Funny. Both y'all said, man, how y'all feel about I'm a red, bro? Talk about hey, it's I like it. It's, just, it's a conversation that's been had for years in the barbershop. So hey, like she it. ain't told one lie in my book. She ain't told. Hey, she ain't. Hey, she ain't say now, now lie, now lie. Is she blowing she up, bro? What's up with her, man? She 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 said the industry kind of scared of her. I, I don't know about that one. Uh, she's gonna love hip hop either, this season. You know how they everybody say the industry scared of me until they get up there. They yeah, like, then they, they, be like, like, oh, they, 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 they just, didn't give a fuck. They be like, "Oh, you be missing your call time. They ain't scared of you. You just don't be." Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> right. your call time was eight, and you can't hear it ten. They put they cut you off the show. The fuck. Right. It's not that long. It's not Atlanta. Not Atlanta. The funny hey, part about hey. that, she in the stadium, and it's not Atlanta. The stadium they in is not Atlanta no more. And where that, where that stadium at? Let them, let them boy know that stadium That's in Cobb County. That's Cobb County. Fuck you but talking about. But they kind of annexed yeah. it. Yeah, you but they annexed about, it right? or something. They made that one circle Atlanta. It's weird. They can change whatever they want me? to. We don't own none of this shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, but I'm glad she told everybody that Gwinnett is not Atlanta. Because a lot the of niggas stand in Atlanta. Atlanta. And they think that's the north side. That's not the north side. Clark yeah. County is the real north side. I don't know what the fuck that shit is way out there. That shit so is Cobb County. County, Cobb County, or is Cobb County Atlanta? Cobb County is Cobb County. Cobb that's County, Cobb County. Don't get it. Don't get it. Don't get it. That's where the police get. Don't get the get confused, get uh, Detroit ass nigga. I fuck with Detroit. Ass, man. Why you mad at me? Because don't nobody agree with your lotion choice, nigga. You put it in the Hey, hey, he was done. Nigga, he was man. done with nobody like the lotion. He was like, you know what? Shoot it all, y'all. Yeah. Them niggas lame as fuck, man. Them niggas, them nigga hating on my lotion, man. Oh man, cherries though, cherries though. Hey, cherry, I'm gonna be hitting my boy. That shit be hitting my boy. You smell like a uh, frappe. Hey man, I smell delicious, man. Hey, I'm all right, man. Hey, with that being said, man, this has been another episode of Roast This. I'm your host, Brandon Lewis. And hey, we out of time, babe, boy. I, I got know, man, my bad. I saw you, everybody. 
I'm trying to get ready. They about to come get me to go to the airport in like an hour, man. Yeah, so I had to get all my good, stuff man. Ready. We love you, dog. But but last but not least, man, before before we exit, you all you already know we always let the people know what we got going on for the week, man, so they can check us out, they can buy the merch, they can support us. Uh starting with Ronnie Jordan, man. Let the people know, man. Uh y'all go to my YouTube channel, subscribe, like some share some stuff. Uh YouTube backslash Ronnie Jordan. Go to More Than Culture. That's the podcast, that's the brand, that's the homies. Uh, we got part two of the TI interview up on More Than Culture on YouTube. Uh, M O R E T H A N. That shit was hard too, by the way. Bro. T uh, U L T R. Appreciate y'all, man. We, we out here just trying to. That TI was hard as fuck, boy. Yeah, we. I've been telling him to do comedy for a while, and he did it, and he's taking off. So yeah, I ain't mad at nobody. Fuck, you know what I'm saying? But we got some more coming up, man. Y'all keep checking us out. Officialblessedaf.com, merchforhire.com, man. Thank y'all, everybody, for tuning in, man. CP, let the people know, man. Uh, shit, man. What up, though, man? We filming the CP podcast right now, uh, banking episode. So that's dropping sometime. Probably like, oh, drops on 420. First oh. episode drops on 420. Um, super excited about it. And then uh, I'm headed back to the East Coast. So, you know, I'm about to be back in the clubs on the East Coast. I'm about to be back filming and uh, trying to wrap it up quick so I can get back and uh, do the season of Roast Me. Shout out to that, man. And uh, oh, yeah, last man. but not least, man. Last but not least, I'm your host, Brandon Lewis, man. You can follow me on social media, Instagram, at who is Brandon Lewis, man. Make sure you follow each and every one of us on this caffeine platform. I'm Big Bang Lewis. That's Comedian CP. That's Ronnie Jordan. Also, man, shout out to my nigga in Austin, Texas, man. Go with the spicy candy, man. So if you are interested in that Mexican flavor, hot and spicy candy, got all sorts, man, man. Spice guy right Sorcerer. there. Instagram is Dub James, man. Send me a care package, man. Right there, man. Shout out to Dub. But also, man, I got hey. merch on the way, man. What's See up, if bro? he got any uh ginger snap cookies with pink Himalayan salt on them. Okay, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna eat him up and see if he got that. Last but not least, man, my merch will be dropping soon, man. You see the Lewis is the brand. Merch coming soon, man. But other than that, man, make sure you tell a friend and tell a friend to watch us each and every Tuesday. At 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. And make sure that you guys tune in next Wednesday, March 30th, for the grand opening, the opening season, the beginning of where it begins, season five of Roast Being a Classroom Edition. Man, I'm your host, Brandon Lewis. That's CP. That's Brandon Jordan. And we are out. Let's go. My thoughts on this episode is that the the person they brought on Prentice Johnson and Chris Mosley I don't think they were prepared to actually roast like I said earlier you must be able to have that mindset to know that you are going up against professionals so you must be prepared at all times so you must be able to know that your Wi-Fi and your connection is strong so you won't have any issues if you want to have this opportunity to be on the show, you must take it as an opportunity, a serious opportunity and a serious chance. So that's my thought and everything else, whatever I have you, it was okay. And CP's birthday and everything. Ronnie isn't too funny to me. I don't know. He may have some good jokes here and there, but he isn't too funny. Every time CP tells a joke. He always have to join. He don't have anything to say back to him like that. But um, other than that, it was a good episode. Thank you for watching. Until next time, peace.